Yo, every fall I always grow my beard. So I was growing it for like a week when I went to the barber shop a couple weeks ago and I told my barber, yo, I'm keeping my beard. Cool. And then last week I went to the barber shop. I forgot to tell him. He also forgot. And now here we are. That set me back like a month. Intro. Yo, what up? My name is Vladimir Richet from ChaseAndRider.com. This video is going to be quick. Well, for two reasons. Number one, this is part two of the best shoe order program. So I'm not going to go into all the details that I went into in the first one. But more importantly, it's 420 in the morning, man. Anyway, so let's get to it. The best custom shoe program, in my opinion, is the collection group order through Yale Sal. So back in June, the collection group order that they had going at the time was on the Pie Cross apron. But now that we're in the fall, heading towards the winter, the new collection group order is going to be on boots. So what makes this the best group order program? Typically with group orders, everybody either has to pick the same leather or they have to pick the same style or both. With Yale Sal, in the first iteration of their collection group order, once again, the Pie Cross apron, there was four different styles of shoes to pick from. And also, everybody could pick their own leather. You didn't have to pick all the same leather. So that's what makes this group order program so special, but they took it up a notch. This time around, they doubled it, so now there are eight different options to choose from. As if I wasn't indecisive enough. So let's start from the top. In order for this program to be funded, there has to be at least six orders. When I checked earlier today, today's October 4th, well, it's October 5th now, because it's four in the morning. But when I checked earlier today, they already had five orders. So there's no worries that this is not going to fund. This is a guarantee. But the way it works, there are two different tiers this time. I believe last time there are three different tiers, but this time it's only two different tiers. But before we get into the tiers, let's talk about the price. They start at $595. The reason why I say they start at $595 is because one of them has a pie cross apron and that one is $630. That's because a pie cross apron is hand stitched. So there's always an upcharge whenever you're dealing with a pie cross apron. So as I was saying, there are only two different tiers this time. The first tier is if they can get 15 orders, everybody get 5% off the order. The second tier is 40 orders. So if they can get 40 orders, not 40 additional orders on top of the 15, including the 15, everybody gets 10% off the shoes. So instead of $595, you're looking at $535. Now we're talking about hand welted boots under $600, which is absolutely crazy. But if we can get more people to join, we can pay even less. So let's go to all the different models. There are some tall boots and some short boots in no particular order. The first one is the Patterson. If you're familiar with the Galway from Edward Green, if not, those boots retail for $1,610. And every single shoe company in the world has their own version of the Galway, but the Galway is the original. So the Patterson is Yosal's take on the Galway. The second one is the Dempsey which is a split toe with a pie cross apron. I think that that one's probably going to be the most popular one, if I had to guess, because it's such a unique makeup. Once again, that's the only one that's $630, as opposed to $595, because when we're talking about a pie cross apron, that's something that's done by hand, so therefore it takes more time. The third option is the Vista, which is a Chelsea. The fourth option is the Grange, which is a chucker boot. The fifth option is the Dre Scott, which is also a chucker boot. The only difference is in the facing. One of them has a round facing, one of them has a pointy facing. The sixth option is the Bartley, which is a punch Adelaide. The seventh option is the Queensway. That's a plain Adelaide with a V-shaped design. And last but not least, the eighth option is the Loney, which is a jumper boot. Once again, eight different options to pick from, all excellent options, so it's really just a matter of preference. So there are some upcharges that you should be aware of. Museum calf, some suede leathers, and some grain leathers come with a $40 upcharge. If you want metal toe tips, that's a $30 upcharge. Something like a Vibram insert is a $15 upcharge. And last but not least, the shoe trees are also going to be an upcharge. One thing that Yale Sai has that's really cool is a three-piece lasted shoe tree for the boots. 
and those are eighty dollars. But those are really nice, man. It's really hard to find good quality shoe trees for boots, especially for high boots. But I think that the three-piece lasted shoe trees is definitely worth the upcharge. Once again, the great thing with this program, everybody can do their own thing, man. So the chances of somebody else's boots looking exactly like yours are very, very slim since there are so many different options to choose from. The great thing about this program, which is different than most group orders, is you don't have to pay the whole thing up front. You only have to pay half and you pay the other half before the shoe ships. Also, very important to note, if you get the shoes and you don't like them, you can return them, no questions asked, and your side will charge you a 20% restocking fee. This is why I call this program the best custom shoe program under $600. So even with the boots, they're still under $600, unless of course you're talking about the Dempsey. The turnaround for these is about eight to 12 weeks. So right now, yield so I think that the shoes will arrive sometime between late December and mid January. Where else are you going to get hand welted boots for under $600. And if you can get 40 guys to join, we can pay $535 for hand welted boots, man. By the way, once again, I said this video was going to be short. I'm not going to go over all the options. If you haven't seen the previous video that I made back in June about the Pie Cross Apron Collection group order, I'm going to link it somewhere up here, also included in the description. In that video, I go into more details about all the different options that you can personalize with your order. But this is a really great program. This is not really going to come back around. Guys always tell me how come I don't have any boots, so I'm trying to rectify that now. I do have another pair of boots coming from a different maker, but I'm also really looking forward to these boots. So let me know in the comments what you're going to order and then when they come you can tag me on Instagram My handles chase that rider. So are you going to join this group order? I definitely feel like you should. Where else are you going to find head lasted boots under $600 man? It just doesn't really happen. So I know some guys are going to get more than one pair. I think the Patterson might be out even though I really want that style of boot. I'm getting one from a different maker so it doesn't really make a lot of sense for me to get two of the same style of boot when I have no other boots besides those. So I'm really leaning towards the Queensway, but as far as what leather I'm going to get, it's anybody's guess, man. <laughs> as you guys know, I'm very indecisive. So this closes on October 20th. I'm probably going to make up my mind on that day at 11.59 p.m., man. <laughs> All right, guys, it's five o'clock, man. I'm going to sleep. Hit the thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe. Everybody gonna think that you're a hater. And I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.